Good morning students. I hope you all have understood about various functions of roots. As I have already told you that shoot is a part of a plant that grows above the ground. Today I will discuss the topic shoot system in detail. Now open your book on page 17. first i will discuss the term of this topic that is trunk the hard and woody stem of a tree now let's start reading the shoot system the shoot consists of stem branches leaves buds flowers and fruits underlined word consists of and write its meaning includes let us learn about different parts of the shoot system and their functions underline word functions and write its meaning purposes students the stem is the main part of the shoot system and it grows above the soil it bears branches leaves buds flowers and fruits now next paragraph stem stem is a long supportive part of a plant stem may be hard or soft now look at this picture this is a long part of a plant known as stem and it gives support to a plant now next line coriander mint and spinach have soft and thin stems students stem can be of different size color or shape it may be soft or hard now come along mango and neem trees have hard and woody stems when the stem becomes woody it is called trunk underline this term hard and woody stems is called trunk students stems of big trees are thick strong and woody they are covered in a bark this type of stem is called trunk Now let's start with the functions of stem. Stem performs the following functions. Number 1 support. Underline word support and write its meaning to hold. Stem supports branches, buds, leaves, flowers and fruits. It also helps the plant to stand upright. Underline word upright and write its meaning straight students stem bears branches buds leaves fruits and moreover it helps the plant to stand straight now second point transportation underline word transportation and write its meaning carrying stem moves water from roots to its leaves buds fruits and flowers underline word moves and write its meaning supplies stem also moves food made in leaves to all parts of the plant students look at this picture stem supplies water and nutrients absorbed by roots to all parts of the plant and it supplies food prepared by leaves to all parts of the plant now third point storage underline word storage and write its meaning the act of storing something 
Some plants store food and water in their stems. Cacti and some other desert plants store water in their stems. Children, as you know, deserts receive very little rainfall. So, these areas have very little underground water. Plants like cactus, palm and acacia that grow in desert areas store water in their stems. Next time, potato is an underground stem. It stores food in it. Underline word underground and write its meaning below the surface. Another stem that grows under the ground and stores food in it is ginger. We eat both of them as food. Children, some stems like turmeric, ginger, potato grow under the ground. Such stems store food and eaten by human beings. So, these are called edible stems. Now, let's revise. Explain the functions of stem. Number one, stem bears branches, leaves, fruits, buds and flowers. Number two, it keeps the plant straight. Number three, it carries water and minerals to other parts of the plant. My second question, name some stems which store food in them. Sugarcane potato, ginger, etc. store food in them. Tomorrow, I will continue with the next topic. Till then, read the chapter and revise questions. Thank you.